So now what we're going to do is figure out how to get a user's GPS coordinates or their location using JavaScript. And this is very useful for providing personalized services in that area. So what we do is we use this object called Navigator, which is available straight from vanilla JavaScript. And it's an object that the browser provides and it gives it some information. So if we just have a look at this right here, we can see that the Navigator object has a bunch of information that this Chrome browser has provided. So we have information about the user agent, the language, and all of this information is used to specialize or like set preferences for what how stuff is displayed. So we can, for example, use the performance or the user agent to personalize the experience. Now, the field we're interested in right here is the one called geolocation. And this geolocation has a method called get current position, which can be used to get the latitude and longitude. So before we run this method, the first thing we need to do is make sure that this geolocation exists. And if it doesn't exist, there'll be errors if we try to run this method. So what we can say is if navigator dot geolocation, and that just makes sure that we have this to work with first. Then what we need to do is we're gonna say navigator dot geolocation dot get current position and this method takes in a function to run once we get a position and the input for that function is the position data and then I can just go ahead and do something like log the position. So what this should do is it should request my location and then it should try and log the position. So if I run this now, as you can see, we have a prompt here asking to use our location. I'm going to block it for now because I don't want to expose that. And now because I haven't allowed it, this doesn't work. But if you allow it, it will log the position data right here. So what they want us to do here is just to display the user's location data right here. So the first thing we want to do is we want to check if the geolocation exists. So I'm just going to say if navigator dot geolocation. And then we're going to open this up and we're going to say navigator dot geo. I'm going to be careful with the spelling here. Geolocation dot get current position position like this and we're going to take in the position with a function and all they want us to do is set the data elements in a html to the lat to show the latitude and longitude so i'm just going to copy this and paste it in here so what it says is when we get the location object back, the latitude and longitude will be stored in this property of position called chords. So we just want to say latitude is and then display the latitude, longitude is and then display the longitude. And that should show up right there. So yeah, that's everything we need for this challenge. So I'm just going to run this. Oh, your code should use navigator.g. Oh, my bad. The geolocation in this is case sensitive. So I'll run this again. And now you can see that it asks, asks to access the location. So regardless of what I do, this should be all we need for this task. So if I run this, yeah, that has worked perfectly.